Hey everyone, welcome back to another video of Gitroy Tips and in this video I'm gonna talk about how to fix Epic Games login error, can't log in on your Epic Games and how you can fix this up. So let me directly get into this step. So the first one is all about, we have to go over here, search for run like this or you can go over here, click on the run so that this will be opening up or you can just press a shortcut from the keyboard that is Windows and R together so you'll be getting this. Now from here, we have to type percentage local app data percentage. We have to type this and once afterwards go for OK. Now that will be taken you to this and if you scroll down, you can see this. We have two folder for the Epic Games and we have a folder for the Epic Games launcher. So select this one, right click and go for trash. Similarly, go for the Epic Games launcher as well, go for the trash. So just go over here and if you're not able to complete this particular action, action which means it is running in the background. So the first one, go over here, cross check whether the Epic Games is running in the system tray. Just go over here and you have to remove it. Once it is removed, we just need to go back. And what we need to do, just go over here, click on the trash once again and go for it once again. And if still, if it's not working, cross check. Over here, you can see it is still on the system tray. So right click over here, there is an option to exit. Go for exit. Now you can go back to the folder, right click and go for the trash. So it will be deleted. So this particular two folders is causing the issue up so you don't have to worry or neither you don't have to take the backup whenever you try to launch the game these two folders will be recreated back. Now go back close this and try launching the Epic Games and you have to check with Epic Games is working fine or not. So still you are having with Epic Games launcher then you have to move to the next one. Just go over here in this start right click and navigate to the task manager. Now from here you have to expand this up, you can see if the Epic Games is running over here in the task manager in the background, you need to remove it. So right now I'm not able to find the Epic Games because I have removed it or you can search for the Epic Games like this over here and make sure the Epic Games is not running over here in the background or neither what we need to do is you can see in the background process we have to make sure the Epic Games is not running. Once after the Epic Games, if we find the Epic Game, just right click on the Epic Game and go for the end the task and remove the end the task from the task manager and you have to close this and go back. Next one is all about we need to go over here, search for the control panel and you have to click on this one. Now from here what we need to do is go to the programs and from here click on the programs and features. Now from here scroll down and you can see the Epic Games launcher. What we need to do is what we need to just click on right click, go for the repair so it is going to in a little bit of time will be taken for the same so you have to do the same for the epic games launcher and also for the epic online service as well both has to be done go for yes and now once it is successfully done you have to go for the epic online service as well and also most probably what i'm recommending is you can try for the epic games launcher so this is going to take a little bit of time so i'll be waiting for this to reach completely done and i'll be moving to the next step in the video, I'll be skipping this part or making it fast so that you don't get bored. So once it is done, what we need to do is we just need to move to the next step. That is all about just go over here. You have to search for the Epic Games Launcher or right click on the Epic Games Launcher. Right click over here like this. You have to select it and right click and go to show more options, properties, go to the compatibility. And now from here click on disable the full screen optimization and we have to click on run this program as an administrator. Go for apply and go for OK. Last and the least step, just go over here for add or remove just click on this particular one over here now from here what we need to do is you can see there are a lot of apps installed on this particular device and you have to search for the epic games now if you find the epic games launcher just go over here click on this three dot menu and go for the uninstall and once the uninstall is done you have to re-download it back by going over here in the side so just go over here and you can download the epic games launcher once again and that is what we have to do you can download it back and you can download it from here 
so these are the steps you can try out and i hope this quick video is helpful see you soon next video bye